Welcome back to Magnet Fishing with Sean. It's been forever. I'm super hyped to throw my magnet out today. Hopefully you guys enjoyed that little beginning. I want to do something a little bit different. Change up the video a bit. I want to try to get better at my editing and add more things and just change it up, you know? Um, so I'm not the same every video. We're just casting, you know? Oh, there's a video in the as long as my bucket doesn't run away on me. It's super windy out today, so we'll see. And, I mean, it's not necessarily cold, it's just windy. Um, I got my gloves, I got long sleeve shirt on, my sweatshirt here, and my nice hat. I was trying to find my Kratos one, but I couldn't find it. So let's throw it. It's almost like relearning this again. It's been so long. I mean, I've, I guess I haven't technically done this a year yet, so. Yeah, let's throw that in and see what we get. I'm super hyped. Oh my gosh, there goes the bucket. No, no, no. Oh shoot, hold on. My Kratos this almost went in the river. Woo. Oh my gosh, I might have to put this stuff in my car. That's what I might have to do until I get some stuff. I think that's what I'll do. I almost lost my Kratos crate. That could have been so bad. We can't even get into the first throw yet. All my stuff's blowing away. I'm telling you, it's windy out. So I'm gonna put this in the vehicle until I get some more stuff and then I'll have to grab my, my bag and everything. But yeah, that could have been so bad. It started flying away and I'm like, oh no. All right, I'll come back when I have this stuff in the car. Besides catching the bridge, this is the first piece we ended up getting. It's some type of railroad piece. But let's throw it back in and see what we can get. Got a bunch of little scrap pieces on this as well. Alrighty, here we go. Back in we go, and hopefully we don't get a bridge the second time. Alrighty, guys. Uh, I think we got our first find of the day. Sorry, a train was coming through. Uh, so let's pull this on in. Uh, actually, let me put my glove back on. I took it off so I could push the record button. Um, I can feel something. I don't know why, but my phone feels like it's gonna fall out of the tripod thing I have here. Oh, not the bridge. Oh, why the bridge? Oh, shit. Whoops, I didn't mean to say that. <laughs> Whoops. Oh, jeez. Oh, come on. This is making me look like a freaking fool. Oh, Jesus. Well, man, what a good throw. Caught the bridge. I'm not sure what I got, but I got something super big and like I can't I literally can't pull this thing in it's oh man can't even see it it's underneath the bridge pretty good uh, but I'm going to keep working at this and see if we can get it pulled in if not uh, we're probably going to move on to a different spot because I can't seem to find too much besides this big thing I don't know what it is so I threw out about that way and I'm pretty sure we got something it feels a lot heavier than the last things I've been pulling up this has got some weight to it. What do we got? Some type of, oh jeez, railroad piece? Maybe? What is this? Oh jeez, there we go. Yeah, it's one of those uh, J, I don't know if they're called J pins or, but they're for the railroad. Pretty neat. Hopefully we find some more bigger stuff like that. We pulled in our first railroad spike of, I would say this year, yeah. That would make sense. We're gonna keep throwing in. I felt a few things. Either uh, either my magnet's getting stuck in mud, or I feel something. So I'm gonna give it a few more goes, and then we'll probably move on to one other spot before the sun sets. What this is, but this was definitely buried in the mud. Can't really tell. At first, I thought it was part of a brake caliber, like one half of it. But at the same time, it doesn't look like it though. I'll get it in the sun there for you guys. If you guys have any ideas, I guess throw it in the comments below. But. Honestly, I don't really know what this is from. And I guess last find for this spot is just this piece of bar. Nothing crazy. It's starting to get a little bit chilly now. We're going to move on to one more spot, and then I'll probably wrap it up. Alrighty guys, so we're at the second spot. And I can only be here for a little bit, just because I have some stuff I got to do. Um, but first toss, I might have to come over here more. I know this stuff was here beforehand, but we got some type of box. I thought it was a money box at first, but... Honestly, I don't really know. Do you guys have any, um, I guess, guesses what this could be? 
Um, let me know. It looks like some type of radio, I'm assuming. There's some type of cord, and I don't know. It looked like it would be dials, but I really don't know, to be honest. I'm going to do probably three more throws, and i got to head home. Um, but I'll definitely be back to this spot. Hey guys, I'm back home now. Um, thought I had more time than I did, so we didn't get to really do any more throws after that fine that we got. Um, let me know what you think. I'm thinking it's either some type of electrical box, or radio, or maybe a money box, but honestly, I don't really know. Um, probably going to mess around with it tomorrow um, and see what it is. Mask, uh the rusty magnets, Clay, see if he knew or had any ideas of what it would be. Um, but let me know if you guys are enjoying these videos. Um, I'm trying to change it up a little bit, as you've seen in the beginning of this video. Um, but yeah. Like, comment, and subscribe. Oh, also, before I forget, before I end the video, um, please use Magnet Sean 12, I believe it was, for 12% off of Kratos Magnetics and gear. I believe that's what that used for, but I know the magnets for sure. So if you guys are looking to get a good magnet, definitely go and check out Kratos Magnetics for 12% off. All right, guys, I'll see you guys in the next one. Definitely be looking out for videos because I'm definitely going to be out a lot more now. But thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.